just managed to get in front of this machine. This is the MX330 here at the Matsura Open House. Firstly, I want to take a look or put the camera into a position where you can see the sort of available capacity that we have here and the setup on this five axis table. You can see we've got a cube on there and you've got different components on different faces. Uh, this is really what this MX330 is about and why it's proving to be so popular uh, for not just subcontract machinists, but production machinists as well. Uh, I want to take you through to the area and hopefully we, we may be able to um, get this door open here. Uh, yeah, great, because part of the 330 here, well, the, the key to the success of this 330 is not just a five axis element, it's what you can see here about the flexibility. And talking to Matsuro over recent months since the machine has started going into the field and they've got lots of installations already, the benefit that most engineers are finding is the fact that the different types of components that you or the, the different quantities of different types of components is where you really get the benefit to this machine and that's been illustrated here you'll see on each pallet station you have a different component on a different face of the cube so a lot of engineers do tend to look at these these solutions and they think to themselves I need a thousand off of a particular part to get the benefit out of automation couldn't be far you couldn't be more wrong I mean this is a perfect example of how you, can, how you can have smaller quantities and lots of different products and get the benefit of the unmanned run because this machine will, one, will run through the night as a result of its pallet system.